This video is to know how to apply the Fleming's left hand rule under a certain situation. For that the situation, imagine that you are sitting in a chamber with your back to one wall. An electron beam is moving horizontally from a back wall towards a front wall. It is deflected by a strong magnetic field to your right side. What is the direction of magnetic field? So the question belongs to the NCRT science class 10 th 13th chapter magnetic effects of electric current. I have rewritten the statement so that when I discuss I can show you the points in this. Imagine that a person is sitting with his back to one of the walls. So imagine that this is the wall. This person's right hand, this person's left hand. Now the question, imagine that you are sitting in a chamber with your back to one wall. Done. An electron beam is moving horizontally from a back wall towards the front wall. Electron beam is coming from back wall to front wall. If this is the direction of electron, then exactly its opposite is the direction of electric current. So direction of electric current is from front wall to the back wall. So electron beam is a traveling from a back wall towards the front wall. In that case a direction of electric current is from front wall to back wall. And this is by conventional direction of electric current. So that electron beam is deflected by a strong magnetic field to your right side. So electron beam is deflected towards the right side. So this is the direction of displacement. Direction of displacement of the electron. With this information we have to tell the direction of magnetic field. Right. So force field current. Force magnetic field electric current. So electric current is set. Uh, force. Force means which direction force applied that direction the displacement also occurs. And we want the direction of magnetic field. So force field current. So current direction. Current direction is from front wall to back wall. Thumb is a direction of force. Means which direction force applied that direction displacement. So current as I turn my left hand like this. By putting these three fingers mutually at right angles. The thumb is uh, towards the right side. The forefinger gives the direction of magnetic field which is vertically inwards. So direction of magnetic field is uh, vertically inwards. So the cross symbol talks about the direction of magnetic field. Cross symbol means magnetic field is inwards. Dot means magnetic field is outwards. So I should put a cross symbol to tell the direction of magnetic field. The direction of magnetic field is vertically inwards.